Hey guys, it's the New Hampshire Real Fan here, back with another episode of Vengeance of Conway Scenic Railroad. In this installment, we'll be talking about Main Central number 573. So with that, let's get right into it. Freight train, freight train, going so fast. Freight train, freight train, going so fast. I don't care what train I'm on, as long as it keeps rolling on. The engine was built by EMD as GP7 number 573 in September of 1950. When the Main Central purchased this engine, she was one of 19 originally owned Main Central GP7s, which were numbered between 561 through 569 and 571 through 580. 573 was delivered in a reverse Yellowbird paint scheme, which is essentially the same thing as the standardized Main Central Yellowbird livery, just swapped from yellow to green. 573 had a pretty good track record for zero derailments and almost no mechanical flaws. On the 28th of October, 1981, Near Miles Pond in Concord, Vermont, 573 was trailing in a two-locomotive consist behind at number 258, which was also a main central engine, a GP38, and they were hauling 11 cars northbound. Just after passing Miles Pond, the consist derailed, including all 11 freight cars, due to a washout that occurred from heavy rain the previous night. 573 was resurrected from the derailment and sustained substantial damage to her steam generator and her hood. 573 was stored at the Waterville shops in Maine and was eventually repaired by July of 1982. She was repainted into the Red Wing livery after having her steam generator replaced in early July 1982. She was tested on the 22nd of July and after further inspections put back into service shortly afterward. In 1983, shortly after the Boston and Maine acquisition from the Guilford Rail System, 573 was repainted into the Big G paint scheme, retaining the number of 573. Ditch lights were also later applied to the locomotive around the same year. On September 26th, 1983, 573 pulled the Operation Lifesaver train paired with GP7 number 470 to North Conway. I was unable to find much information on this event, but I found many photos of crews reheading the locomotives to the opposite side of the train whilst at the Conway Railroad Station. In April of 1984, 573 had the main central markings on the side of her hood changed to Delaware and Hudson. This was later reverted back to, say, main central only a few weeks later. She would be re-identified again in 1988 to Springfield Terminal and renumbered to 27. In 1995, 27 was purchased by Conway Scenic Railroad and was moved to their property by EMD F7, number 4266. There, she underwent a slight overhaul and was repainted back to her Red Wing paint scheme and also renumbered back to 573. She began pulling passenger excursions almost immediately after. In 2021, she was named in honor of late engineer Gordon Lang, who sadly passed away May 21st, 2023. 573 frequently pulls the valley train and can occasionally be spotted on trips to Crawford Notch on the Notch train. She is also often used with work extras and heritage excursions.